In the end it was Tom Izzo and the Michigan State Spartans cutting down the net with a 64 to 52 win over Louisville the number one overall seed to advance to the final four in Detroit Gus Johnson along with my partner Len Elmore and what a performance by this Michigan State team they were prepared offensively and defensively played with a great level of energy and now they're heading to Detroit and the final four well it was an outstanding game plan that was executed extremely well. I mean, Michigan State didn't turn the ball over against the pressure. It was a team effort, but the guy who led the effort, Goran Sutan, who was tremendous, not only inside the paint, but the ability to stretch the Louisville defense by knocking down some threes. Excellent on the boards as well, and certainly delivered some timely passes for some easy baskets. The guy in the second half who helped break this game open, Darrell Summers, beneficiary of some penetrating kicks, either by the dribble or off the pass. But Summers, again, stepped up when his team certainly needed him. And as I said, a team effort. Everybody contributed. Excellent defense and a great offensive game plan. So an upset for Michigan State uh, defeating Louisville. Now they will take on Connecticut in the Final Four. Different story. Connecticut has the great shot blocker in Thabit. Well, Connecticut's somewhat similar to Louisville in their athleticism. But you're right. Hashim Thabit is a game changer, a guy in the middle who can seal off the middle. Now, what's going to have to happen with Michigan State? They're going to look for Sutan once again to step outside, try to draw the beat outside. But it comes down to, again, maintaining their poise, not turning the ball over too much, and certainly able to manage the game and find ways to get the beat out of the middle. But more importantly for Michigan State, they had a, they have a chance to go back to Detroit, 75 miles away from their campus, and this will virtually be a home game for them, so they will be playing uh, with a lot of fan support behind them. Well, they certainly would be, and again, they played here in hostile territory. Primarily, this was a Louisville crowd, but Michigan State overcame that, and I think they'll feel very much at home at Ford Field in Detroit. All right, for my partner, Len Elmore, on his birthday, by the way, I'm Gus Johnson saying so long from Indianapolis, Michigan State. will be playing for this when they head to Detroit and the Final Four, the National Championship Trophy.